I'm Macho Zero One Nine Four, and in this video today I'll be showing you how to get out of recovery mode loop on your iPhone having 615.00 baseband. I previously made a video on iPhone 3GS having 615.00 baseband recovery mode loop face and that had most of the people and many people requested me to make a video on iPhone 3G. So this video is only for iPhone 3G. If you're having iPhone 3GS just click right here between my two fingers and it will take you to the video that I made for iPhone 3GS. So uh, this video is for only iPhone 3G and you have to download two things. Number one you have to download the iRap. I will put the link in the description for this iRap and number two you have to download the custom firmware that I made and you have to restore through this custom firmware so once these two things are downloaded put it on your desktop now open up this iRap and run it as uh, administrator this iRap actually allows you to put your device in porn state DFU mode if you don't use iRap you will get errors like 1600, 1632, 1602 or 1603 so you have to select the appropriate device that you're having this story is for iPhone 3G so have, you have to check here iPhone 3G and now you have to press the power and the home button and follow the instructions okay follow the instructions uh, given in this iRap Okay. Once your device in pawn state DFU mode, your iTunes will recognize it and you will hear a beep on your uh, computer uh, if you are using PC. So, now my iTunes will recognize it. Now you can close this uh, iRap and now your iTunes is uh, contacting iPod or iPhone software update server. So once it's done, you have to click here OK. After that, you have to press Shift on your keyboard and you have to click on this Restore. And you have to browse this firmware. We are having my iPhone 3G in tip top working condition, so I will not restore using this firmware. But if you're having a recovery module problem, you have to click on it and you have to restore this firmware. And when you restore this firmware, you will be having Syria after it. You don't need to install or jailbreak it because uh, you are already having Syria. This is custom firmware, the Syria is already present there. And once Syria is there, you just have to go to um, Syria and you have to unlock it using Ultra Snow. You don't need to load iPad's baseband and you don't need to have uh, jailbreak again so that's about it and I hope that this video will help most of the people and yeah that's pretty much about it and if you like my video consider subscribing me and thanks a lot for watching